Hi Pisces, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do uh, Who's Coming Towards You in May. This is for singles, right? Okay, singles. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is basically, you know, what you can expect if you're single and you're looking or whatever. What can you expect? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Ooh, Four of Wands, Reverse, not a good start, and you guys can... Point the finger at me if you'd like. That's fine. Um, mm, page of Wands reversed. Five of Wands reversed. Knight of Swords. Temperance. Ooh, Knight of Wands. Ooh, you guys got a new beginning here. Somebody is moving in a new direction. Looks good, actually. It does. Somebody is moving in a new direction. Somebody's taking that step. Very hasty, too. Fast action. Somebody is moving very, very quickly in a new direction. It may not start out good, but it looks good. Okay? It may not start out good. You may receive some bad news or, you you know, you may have received something, you know, you may have been dealing with a negative situation that didn't turn out the way you wanted that made you unhappy, but it looks like it's going to come together nicely. It does. You may have dealt with some conflict here. There may have been a minor conflict or a petty conflict that caused some upheaval in your life, but it looks like things are going to change direction and you are going to get to a more peaceful place. Seriously. We have a new beginning here, a release. This is a major release. This is a transition. These are both transition cards. You are transitioning to a better place, and that is no joke, Pisces. I can't. I can't make it up. So it's good. It is good. Um, this is taking that step, taking a step. And something is happening fast with the Knight of Swords and the Knight of Wands. This is fast action. There is no time to waste. Whatever that is. Ooh, the lovers. So you guys got a uh, love connection here. It's unexpected. This is, you know, an unexpected choice in love. So you may be presented with, you know, an opportunity to basically fall in love. Um, this is a choice. This person may not fit the description. They not may not fit the description that you are usually attracted to. They may not um, be who you thought it was going to be. You know, they're not who you thought it was. You know, they don't look like what you thought they were going to look like. That's what I'm trying to say. But this person can help you to heal. This person and you mix very, very well together. It's a great combination. It really is. There may have been some some conflicts, okay? Or some miscommunication or something like that. That made the partnership... If While well, you're single, right? Huh. So, but maybe you've been talking to this person. I don't know. You're single. This is unhappiness. This could be no commitment, no ha not happiness, no happiness. But things are about to change. That's what this is. You may have been unhappy. You may have not been in a commitment. That is, Things are about to change. That is exactly what this is. So if you have been single, you probably are not going to be single for longer, for much longer. Okay, and honestly, that's what it looks like to me. So, um, things are going to happen fast when they happen. They are. It's going to be like so fast, you probably, you're, you know, your head might spin. Anyway, um, could be dealing with a Queen of Swords, could be a Gemini. We got Gemini here, we got Gemini here. So, you could be dealing with a Gemini, could be Libra or Aquarius as well. We also have Scorpio, we have Sagittarius, we have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius as well up here. So, we have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius up here. Doesn't matter who we got, really. Um, something is going to happen very fast that is going to change 
your partnership status, put it that way. There's a change coming and it is a major one. It's a big one. You're going to have to make a choice. This person does not fit your usual type. They don't look like your usual type, but they are your perfect match. It could be dealing with a queen of pentacles. Beware, she's jealous. You might not like that, but it's the truth. Anyway, um... She definitely speaks her truth, whoever this woman is. This woman is is uh, honest. She's truthful. Um, if it could be a male or a female. But either way, you have somebody that is going to come charging into your life or you're going to charge into theirs. It could go either way. Something is moving forward very, 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 very quickly. And it's going to bring you peace. It's going to bring you balance. This is This is peace. And balance. This is peace. I mean, whatever this is, this is a very healing energy. It's it's going to bring you harmony. It's going to be... So there's going to be a lot of passion there as well. There's going to be passion. There's going to be excitement. This is an opportunity for a new life with somebody that is perfect for you. Even though they don't fit the description. So... This is, this is, uh, this is the time is now. There is a purpose why something ended. Something has ended in, obviously, you wouldn't be watching this reading. There's a purpose. There's a reason. The reason is, is because you have somebody that is perfect for you that is going to be brought into your life. It's going to happen suddenly. You may suddenly fall in love with this person, whoever it is. Um... Now you have an opportunity to step over that edge, to step into the unknown. You have, you have really are going to be presented with a new pathway, okay? It's like all of a sudden this pathway opens up and you have the opportunity to step right into it and experience something you have never experienced before. So Pisces, you do have a new opportunity for love here. It could be with any sign. I see you moving to a much much better place it's a time of transition that leads to it looks like it looks like passion it does so good luck sorry i didn't zoom that in further earlier <laughs>